It was a chilly January morning in 2011, when the tech world buzzed with excitement. Intel had just released its new CPU, the Core i5-2500K. This wasn't just another processor, it was a game changer, a piece of silicon magic that promised to redefine performance benchmarks for years to come. As enthusiasts and professionals alike scrambled to get their hands on it, the echoes of its potential rippled through every corner of the tech community. On May 10th, 2020, the overclocking community was stunned by a groundbreaking achievement. Overclockers known as Dominator and Gulftown had managed to push the Intel Core i5-2500K, a processor released in January 2011, to an astonishing 6.38 GHz. This record-breaking feat showcased not only the potential of the i5-2500K, but also the extraordinary skill and dedication of the team behind the attempt. If you like this video, why don't you hit the subscribe button and like button and we'll see you in many more videos. In a cluttered room glowing with LEDs and humming with cooling fans, an unlikely tech duo was ready for action. The venerable Intel Core i5-2500K and the state-of-the-art Gigabyte 4070 Super GPU. You'd think this old-school CPU and new age GPU combo would be a disaster, right? Wrong. Booting up Apex Legends at 1080p with high settings, the game ran butterly smooth, averaging a jaw-dropping 211 frames per second. It turns out that the trusty i5-2500K, with a little overclocking love, still had plenty of fight left in it, handling the game's CPU demands like a champ. Meanwhile, the 4070 Super flexed its muscles, delivering top-tier graphics performance who knew a nearly decade-old processor and a cutting-edge GPU could team up and create such gaming magic. Talk about an odd couple making sparks fly. In the same neon-lit fan-buzzing room, our legendary Intel Core i5-2500K and the mighty Gigabyte 4070 Super were ready for another round of digital mayhem, this time in Call of Duty Warzone. Expectations were low, bets were high, and as Warzone booted up, it seemed like the vintage CPU might just tap out. But guess what? The dynamic duo pulled a fast one on everyone. Running at 1080p with high settings, the game held a rock-solid average of 170 frames per second. The trusty i5-2500K, like a seasoned veteran with a few tricks up its sleeve, managed the CPU load brilliantly while the 4070 super flexed its graphical muscles like a young action hero. Despite their age difference, these two made an unbeatable team, proving once again that great performance can come from the most unexpected partnerships. Who knew an old-timer CPU and a sprightly GPU could dominate the digital battlefield together? Talk about an odd couple making pixel-packed magic. Our dynamic duo, the Intel Core i5-2500K and Gigabyte 4070 Super were itching for another adventure. This time it was Fortnite's turn to test their metal. With the game set to 1080p and epic settings, the stakes were high, but so were the frames. The result? A dazzling average of 158 frames per second. The i5-2500K, like a wise old wizard, handled the CPU load with grace, while the 4070 Super brought the flashy graphics, making every build battle a firefight smoother than a victory royale. Despite their age gap, this pair proved once again that age is just a number when it comes to tech powers. Who knew a vintage CPU and a hotshot GPU could create such an epic gameplay? Talk about an odd couple making Fortnite magic happen. In the ever-glowing fan-wearing sanctuary of tech prowess, our dynamic duo Intel Core i5-2500K and Gigabyte 4070 Super were ready to kick it into high gear with Rocket League. Set to 1080p and very high settings, expectations were as lofty as a double jump. And boy, did they deliver, rocketing to an astonishing 421 frames per second. The venerable i5-2500K, channeling its inner seasoned pro, Defty managed the CPU load, while the 4070 Super displayed graphics so crisp you think you were watching a live match. This odd couple, with their epic chemistry, made their aerial hit and goal as smooth as a turbo boost. Who knew a vintage CPU and a hotshot GPU could turn Rocket League into such a high-flying spectacle? This pair is rewriting the rules of tech matchups, one frame at a time. In the cozy led lit corner of Tech Haven, our trusty old Intel Core i5-2500K and the snazzy new Gigabyte 4070 Super were ready for the next mission, GTA 5 on ultra settings. The expectation? Frame drops galore. The reality? A rock solid 98 frames per second. 
the Intel Core i5-2500K like a dad who just learned to dab, handled the CPU load with surprising grace, while the 4070 Super made the graphics so sharp you'd think you were driving through the real Los Santos. As they booted up the game, the i5-2500K quipped, why did the GPU get promoted? It really knows how to render good service. The 4070 Super chuckled. Well, why did the CPU stay calm? Because it knew all the threats were under control. Despite their age difference, this duo performed like an old pro and a young hotshot in perfect sync. Who knew a veteran CPU and a fresh-faced GPU could make such a killer combo? This odd couple is proving that with the right partnership, even the classics can still show the youngsters a thing or two about performance. Talk about a pair that's driving GTA 5 straight into the smooth lane of gaming bliss.